Happy New Year, and welcome back to the Playhouse. 2020 has been a year the likes of which that none of us have ever seen, and I hope we never, ever see again. But there is a group of people out there that really did try to make the best of it. There is. The group of collectors. You know, this year, it has been hard to feel good about almost anything. But for those collectors, there are bits and pieces that they can pull out of this past year of misery and make them feel just a little bit better. Well, this year, some friends of Hunting Nostalgia sent me gifts, of which I am eternally grateful for. I can't, I'm just, I'm not going to say it. I can't, I am. I can't thank you enough for this. You know, I, don't, I never expect anything from anyone. I love giving stuff away. I love it. I absolutely love it. But I never, ever expect anything back. I don't. I really, honestly, to truth, I never expect anything back. But um, that doesn't mean when I get stuff, I'm not thrilled beyond words. Okay, uh, I'm going to give you a close-up of some of these items that I received from you from friends of hunting nostalgia uh one i'm going to show you a little preview right now because i think from a distance these things are even cooler I, if that's possible I, if it is possible for the coolness level to go up on these cards that i'm about to show you created by retro sketch my friend wade um i'd love to know what it is because there this is it's absolutely amazing he mashed together two of the most amazing universes of all time it's a great idea he had it years ago the wwf universe and the masters of the universe universe and he forged them into something i'll just show you retro sketch is his name on instagram and probably twitter look oh that's horrible look at that how cool is that Garizlor Monsoon? I mean, oh man, if that's not, it is just so amazing. Feel the power of Skeletor! <laughs> Look at that. It's just amazing. The art, the idea, the concept of this, it is just, it blew me away. First time I saw it, before I even spoke to Wade, the first time I saw images of the macho oh yeah he man let's go yeah i'll protect you no matter what that's right <laughs> and my favorite you know that is not prince adam or terry balia that is he mania and i'm going to show you the friends of these cards uh up close but the creativity the imagination that goes into that is unbelievable. And I want to show you, I got four different things here, four different people, four different friends of Hunting Nostalgia have sent me items. And I'm going to show you and tell you the brief story, I promise it'll be brief, <laughs> of all of them. Good luck assembling all those toys without me. We already did it. Ah, the Ghost of March Future. Now tell me as a kid, you would not have been absolutely thrilled for this to be your haul on Christmas morning. I know that that's exactly how it felt for me whenever I received these items from all of my friends of Hunting Nostalgia. Now, not all of them that I'm going to show you here are Christmas gifts, but I do want to start with the ones that were. And possibly, my, no, you know what? My absolute favorite thing, which I hope they don't sh uh, mind me showing, is um, the actual letter that came along with this package from my friend Julio, um, Virtual Suplex. I'm not going to read you the whole thing because I'll cry, but uh, <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, maybe not. Um, so this is the part to me that just made, just it was unbelievable to see someone actually write this. What I found inside the box is indeed nostalgic, but I don't think that I'm the right collector to possess them. I wanted to pass this box along to someone who would appreciate them more. I immediately thought, of Nick honestly like if if hunting nostalgia gives you any good feelings anything other than you know wanting to punch me singing show tunes all the time um, that is why I do it that's the whole reason for hunting nostalgia is to relay and share that feeling with 
everyone, anyone that's willing to watch my face for that long. That's my objective is to share that feeling with you. And right here, just this little pile. I mean, there are so there was so much in this box that Julio gave me. I, I could do an entire 10 minute video on what he sent. It was that amazing. It was that special and memorable. It's something I will absolutely never, ever forget. And this this note, this letter here, I will have forever forever i will absolutely have it forever to the hunting nostalgia family which is a large group you know it's not it is not just me and elvira doing our thing it is there's other people that help tremendously that i appreciate greatly um but look at this i love stuff like this silly things like this you know you know that if you were getting these in the wwf magazine and popping them out you were not cool enough probably to need them but there it's just so cool and et there were multiple et figures and charlie brown figures in this box which i just absolutely love but look et dressed as a woman how fantastic is that you know there are pogs first off before i et i loved because he mentioned kenner star wars toys that's it like i was wait like i could not wait for that scene i could watch that scene over and over again um that was the reason i loved et it's still the reason that i love et pogs Something so simple, yet Coliseum Home Video had the foresight to know that these were going to be wanted by everyone. <laughs> Look at how great that is. The bite of the bulldog. All of them. But this. This here, which I have said that Julio sent to me, I will be using on my birthday cake. I will show you all. But look at it. It's so amazing. The World Wrestling Federation. The number one name in sports entertainment. Oh, no, maybe it wasn't that at that point. Okay, so Julio sent me just just some amazing, amazing stuff. And um, this isn't a Christmas gift. But this gift from episode six, the king of the Cobra Bats, my friend Dustin. My cameraman was having a bad day. Our, our equipment was not working. There was some horrible sounds coming out. Everything we did that day, two days in a row, actually, were messed up. And he could see how, how much it bothered and how bad my cameraman felt about wasting his time. So Dustin busts out, which I must say, I've already been told whenever I asked to borrow this, I must say, this is being returned. This is not my item. <laughs> it's still, it's an awesome gift that was given to the Hunting Nostalgia family by Dustin. The king of the Cobra Bats. Check out episode six. It's awesome. He's a great, great guy. He is truly, I, I believe, that he is probably one of the most givingest collectors I have ever known. Uh, he loves, just like I do, he loves giving stuff away that he knows people will love. And this was another item that he gave me here. And it was an unbirthday present. It was? <laughs> it was. It was an unbirthday present gave me this little walking this is mark's toys they're supposed to have a little hook there where you pull the hatter along and they walk but still i love it i absolutely love it and then earlier this year i was given a, another gift by one of my friends on here his name is crooked matt his name is matt he's not crooked he's a great guy and he does have one of the greatest beards on instagram hands down one of the best beards you'll ever see he sends me this 1995 Ultra Fleer collection. And let me tell you, the amount of cards in here are, it's just, it's unbelievable. And these were just extras and he had and he found them just sitting around in a garage and he sent them to me. All of these, I have looked through these for hours and hours. My favorite was the Wolverine fight series when he'd be fighting different characters, Sabretooth, whoever, but look at that. Wow, I remember going and buying these packs. I could not wait for the new box to come. Look at that. They're my favorite cards of all time. And just another fan of, you know, I hate saying that. Another friend of Hunting Nostalgia because that is how I truly value everyone, anyone and everyone who ever watches anything that I do. I feel like, you know, that they are my friends. And this here, this was another Christmas gift, but I wanted to save it for last because... Well, it speaks for itself. Now, that's the man right there. His name is Wade. And he is Retro Sketch. That's his Facebook and Instagram. And before the WWE created their mashup series of figures, my friend Wade did this. 
Look at that. And the backs have the... I've already shown the backs. But I just... I can't get enough of them. Look. Andre, the Jyclops. Oh my gosh, it's so great. Brutus the Beast Cake. I mean, it is, it's absolute hilarity. Uh, it, it's unbelievable. Captain Lou Alfisto. <laughs> oh man, I just love it. Each one, each one could, could be on a cartoon. I mean, each one of these, look, that's my favorite. Rattler, Roddy, Viper. Look at the hot Scott mixed with the Rattler. How cool is that? I just, I love these. And um, you can get these, just look up Retro Sketch, you can get these unbelievable Wrestlers of the Universe cards. I, I can't get enough of them, I look at them all the time, but everything here, look at this, these gifts, I, I don't deserve this, but I appreciate it more than, than I can even explain. Thank you very much. I want to thank everybody again all four of you guys and everyone else who has sent me items because this is just this isn't all of it and i feel horrible not showing everything that um that i've been given this year but you know i try to keep these short but whether it be reliving a childhood memory with the hulkster you know on my birthday cake which this will be on i will send you pictures on september 1st of this bad boy running wild on top of my ice cream cake and or you know maybe it was a bad day for a cameraman which i promise like i've said i will give this back it was just for the video just for the video i want to make it perfectly clear how cool though you know cameraman's having a bad day my friend dustin comes out with something that he knows will brighten his day you know stories like this moments like this is what is going to make 2021 a great great year and i can't wait to share more hunting nostalgia with all of you thank you all for watching and thank everyone who has ever given me any gifts at all this is the playhouse let's go hunting nostalgia